Hi there, this is Social Media TV. My name is Tostos. You can call me Tostos Baby sometimes. This is the Hot Plate Show, your favorite lifestyle expo show. On this show, I'll be giving you a tidy download of all the top things you need to live your best life. Stay with me, I'll give you a download after the break. Alright, welcome back. To kick off this very first episode, I'll talk about something you might find very interesting. In the wake of all the craziness and everything that's going on in Nigeria right now, the insecurity, the stress, everybody's just thinking about one thing, a plan B. Everybody wants to do one thing, jackpot. <laughs> so on my very first episode, I'm going to be giving you a top two places you could visit without a visa as a Nigerian. I'm sure you're excited and I bet you don't know any of these two places I mean you know the places but you don't know you didn't know that you could go there without a visa so let's jump right into it so I'm going to use the top two places you could visit without a visa as a Nigerian. The first place on the list is Cambodia. Cambodia is in Southeast Asia. It's bordered by Vietnam and Thailand. If you are a lover of art and history and like buildings, you love museums, you love to see historical things, I feel like you love being in Cambodia. Um, although you need a visa upon arrival to visit Cambodia, when you visit Cambodia, you can stay for up to 30 days without a visa as a tourist, and then after then you can request for a new um, for a visa at about 30 dollars. I've also heard that I've heard some information about people in Cambodia, the locals being racist. I'm not really sure about that, but you could look that up before you go there. The number one place I have for you today is Barbados. I don't know if you've heard of that name before. It's the hometown of Rihanna, Bad Girl Riri. And Barbados is not only famous for being Rihanna's hometown, Barbados is also the birthplace of rum. That's for all you alcohol drinkers. <laughs> no shade thrown. Um, they're also known for their signature dish, the flying cuckoo fish meal never tasted but it sounds really really exotic so Barbados is at my number one list because it's actually the most um, accessible based on the research I did you can stay in Barbados for up to six months without a visa and then you can um, request for a visa after six months compared to Cambodia I heard that um, they don't really allow tourists become residents but it's the opposite case with Barbados. In Barbados, you can stay as long as you want, just that you never have a permanent residence. You just always have to renew your visa, renew your visa, and then. The other things Barbados is good for, um, shopping. Oh my God, the shimmery beaches and the clear waters. You know this water that we used to see in Lagos? It's not water. When you go to Barbados, you will know what water is. Clear water, all this blue water that you see everywhere. So basically, I don't think these are like permanent options. It's just for people that have been going crazy and feel like they need to run away. You can go to these two places on a temporary stay and then walk your way up from there. I hope this was helpful. See you on my next episode. On the next episode, I promise I'm going to have something more interesting. Let us know what you think about these two places. If you know anything that I didn't mention, drop your comments in the section. Follow us on Instagram at Social Media Telly. Follow us on Facebook at Social Media TV. And um, subscribe. Yeah, see you next time. I rain toasters or toasters maybe sometimes. Depends. Bye.